at the mega campus for Ford. Now production at this campus is set to begin in 2025. They're gonna be able to produce over 500,000 EVs. There are so many people around me. Fun activities, fun festivities. We're about to hear from Lisa Drake and CEO Jim Farley. So what are they gonna have to say? Tears, emotional. You know, you know you're gonna change lives for a lot of people. And as much as we're excited about building the truck and building Ford Motor Company, when you see the look on the people's faces here and the interest that they have, and they know that either themselves or their sons, daughters, friends are gonna have good jobs now. I mean, it's just heartwarming. That's Ford executive Lisa Drake, live at the Blue Oval City Experience. Ford is set to build its next electric truck at its new mega campus. The pickup is codenamed Project T3, short for Trust the Truck. There's literally construction everywhere right now. It's raining right now, but we're on a bus getting a full tour. We have a tour guide and everything. So we're going to get some updates on what's going on at this campus. The automaker calls this project a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to revolutionize America's truck and is ready to usher in a new era of American innovation and manufacturing. We are going to make history here. And the progress we made already in such a short time is, in, is really incredible to us. You know, we've been in the car business for 120 years. We built a lot of plants. And to see the progress here is really something. Ford says Blue Oval City is essential to Ford's plan to scale EV production and make EVs more accessible to customers. The company plans to produce 2 million EVs annually across the globe by the end of 2026. This site is going to be the key to Ford's future, more than any other single assembly plant that it operates anywhere around the world, quite honestly. Ford says the site is designed to be its first carbon neutral vehicle manufacturing and battery campus that's being built more efficient than other vehicle plans. The vehicle's designed in such a way, this is the second generation, where we radically simplify the uh, sub assemblies so that it's really simple from the Lego content. Ford and battery partner SK On are investing $5.6 billion in Blue Oval City. The mega campus will also include a battery plant and supplier park. The companies plan to create about 6,000 new jobs at the site that's just 50 miles northeast of Memphis. It's the volunteer state, as Governor Lee mentioned, and we need 6,000 volunteers. And we're going to fill those 6,000 great jobs, and we're going to change the futures of families. Ford also unveiled a talent development program called Blue Oval Learning, a comprehensive education and training effort to prepare future employees. Thank you, Ford, for letting us visit Blue Oval City. Well, that's all we have for today. Thanks so much for watching, everyone. Be sure to follow us on Twitter at Auto News TV and online at autonews.com. This is an incredible experience in Western Tennessee. Stay tuned for more Ford updates and Blue Oval City updates. Reporting in Western Tennessee, I'm Laura Harris, Automotive News.